Hey everybody and welcome back to our channel, your go-to place for smart software walkthroughs and tech tutorials made simple. In today's video, we are going to show you how to create a landing page using Zoho landing page. So whether you're building a marketing funnel, promoting a product, or collecting leads, Zoho landing page offers an easy drag and drop interface to create beautiful high converting landing pages without writing a single line of code. And just a quick reminder that this tutorial is part of our ongoing Zoho series where we explore the different tools in the Zoho ecosystem to help you make the most out of your business offer. So if you are ready to take your online presentations to the next level. Let's begin. Okay, so before you can connect anything to Zoho, you need to create an account. Why? Because Zoho's ecosystem is account-based and that account gives you access to all of the Zoho apps in one dashboard, including the Zoho landing page. Now, the thing is you need to visit the official website of Zoho, which is zoho.com. On the top corner, you have the option to sign up using your work email or your business email. And to make the account creation faster and easier, you can sign up using your Google, your LinkedIn, or your Microsoft account. And then you should be able to access the Zoho landing page builder without any problems once you have successfully created your account in Zoho. Loading times may vary. And at this point, you want to make sure that you are connected to a stable internet connection and you need to provide as much as information as you can because that helps with the Zoho landing page algorithm to provide a customizable dashboard for you. Now here, since um, for example, you just have to be honest right now, we are a freelancer. Okay, so maybe um, let's say it's education. This is the closest for a YouTube how to creation and we're going to create a new page. Right off the bat, you can get started with a template that you may like or best represents your brand or logo. So you can choose from appointment booking, click through, coming soon, discount, ebook, e-commerce, event, and there's basically a lot that you can choose. Now, we're gonna choose uh, the uh, most, um, let's say easiest for now. Uh, I believe I would like to use the uh, coming soon. If you want to preview the template, you want to make sure that it reflects the um, logo and identity or branding of your company or your organization. On the center, you have the uh, desktop view, mobile view or tablet and the mobile view to check its responsiveness. And once you're happy with this, I want you to click the start building because that would forward you to the um, landing page builder and you can rename the page for example zoho landing page if we have that already click the create button and then we will be forwarded to the builder or editor right it'll take a little while and there you have it don't worry because the editor is very easy to use it's user friendly all right and it's not gonna take too much time to learn the uh, the tool because you have the insert button here on the left side that gives you all the tools. You have the sections. That's going to be the header, category, and a, the about section. For example, if you want to add your about section here, you can simply drag and drop. There's going to be a plus button here at the bottom wherein you can simply drag and drop it here. It's very simple and you have successfully created your about section. Now, if you want to edit this, there's going to be a section here for the settings. Okay. And then you have the image. If you want to choose the column, you can do that. All right. You can choose to show one device and you have more settings along the way. I leave the exploration and the creativity to you, but we are here just to show you around. Hold on. The tools right here. If you want to insert more, let's say if you want to add a pop-up, you can create a new pop-up from scratch. And maybe let's say we're going to use this one. Join our community. We're going to create something like that. And it will be added now to the form. And you can drag this basically here. All right. And this is going to be that. And you have more controls here. If you want to customize the border, the spacing and a lot and more. Now, 
if you go back here you can add more headings along the way you can drag it drop it here from text you can also um, put an embed iframe if you're let's say for example working in a um, uh, WordPress and Squarespace if you have a uh, specific website that you want to embed that you can do so you can also add your social profile like LinkedIn Facebook Twitter YouTube and Instagram it's all up to you all right now if you go back to, again to the editor let's click the save and proceed we can we now have the design and the integration if you want to configure the, the pop-up and for the integrations let's click the configure now and then click the save and next So if you are happy with the uh, changes that you have created, I want you to click the preview button just to make sure that all the elements are put together, aligned very well. And then as you may easily notice, I, I believe I've done a, a great uh, job on creating our first landing page. Now, I'm gonna click the publish button so that you would know your options. You have the ability to publish for free and you can configure the time frame to publish and unpublish your landing page. You can schedule it if you wanted, publish on a specific date or maybe publish on that. But for now, we're not going to use that. We can use the publish for free because if you wanted to use a custom domain, it would require you to subscribe to the uh, premium plan. If you're not yet sure if Zoho landing page is going to be the platform that answers your business needs, I want you to skip that for now and go for the publish for free so that you immerse yourself with the platform. Just want to make sure that you are in the right direction and click the publish button. But the subdomain is mandatory and you need to add your domain. For example, in our case, that's that. Click the publish button and then I believe we're good to go. It takes a little while. If you are having issues accessing the um, Zoho landing page website, you want to make sure that you are using a um, VPN because that could interfere with the connection. And if you want to view SEO insights, you also have the ability to do that. You want to make sure that your landing page is going to be great. You can generate a report. You have the leads and analytics sections right all over for you to make an informed decisions about using Zoho landing page to create your first landing page. And again, this is going to be your workspace. And if you want to add a new workspace, you can do that by creating a new page for you or creating a new group depending on your preferences. And you see, you can integrate the Zoho landing page to all these Zoho apps that is part of our Zoho tutorial series. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching our walkthrough on how to create a landing page using Zoho landing page. If you are exploring the Zoho ecosystem, do not forget that this tutorial is part of our Zoho series. Be sure to check out the other videos for more tools and tips that can supercharge your workflow. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.